Loganville Virtual Consultants. Today we're going to show you how you can use Zapier to also create a post in a Facebook page from the addition of a video in a YouTube playlist. If you have not already seen episode 1 in our Zapier tutorial that explains what Zapier is and how you can sign up for Zapier and set up your account with Zapier. We would highly recommend that you view Episode 1, How to Automate Your Business, Zapier Tutorial, Episode 1, where we show you also how to create a Twitter to Discord Zap, and our other videos in our Zapier Tutorial found in our Virtual Consulting YouTube channel. In this case, since I already have a zap created that gets a new video posted in a playlist in YouTube, for which you can see how we created this in our previous video called Pinterest Automated Pin from YouTube Video, How to Automate Your Business Zap Your Tutorial. That shows you how to create this zap which gets a new video posted on a playlist in YouTube and creates a pin in the related board in Pinterest. So what we're going to do in this video is we're going to add an action to also create a post in our existing Facebook page based on the posting of that same video in the playlist in YouTube. Okay, in this example we're going to add an action at the end of that existing zap where we're already selecting a new video in a playlist. So we're going to add an action at the end there. And you can see we can select Facebook pages or in the search bar we can enter Facebook. And one of the selections will be Facebook pages. And in this case I already have a connection and application set up to my Facebook pages uh, account. We can see we're going to choose the event, create page post, continue. We're going to select the account, and again, I already have an application set up. If not, it, you can add a connection. You can see connect to a new account. So I'll select the page that I want. specific page within that account. If you have multiple pages set up within that Facebook pages account you would select that there. Then in the link URL I'm going to select the URL from the YouTube video in the playlist. And now in the message I have a previous zap that I've similarly done for another playlist so I'm, you can see what kind of rich text you can create in the message and I'm just going to copy that one for now and paste it in and then I'll show you how to replace the variables in there but again you can see you can have very rich text uh, you can format however you want uh, you, again, again you can copy paste from an existing zap which makes it even more efficient and then you can see I want to replace the title there with the title from the specific video and I want to replace the URL with the URL from this video and again then you can see how rich the text is that you can put in that message. Okay once we have our message formatted the way we want we can just hit continue and now we can test our action. So we hit test and review We get a message, hopefully, that the page post was sent to your Facebook page successfully, a little green checkbox. And now we can go to our Facebook page, refresh, and then we should see our new posting show up from Zapier with the text that we expect. So now we can see it was published by Zapier just now. We can see the video that it posted, and we can see our rich text, including the variables for which we uh, replace for that new video in the playlist. So you can see how we can very quickly and easily uh, also post to a Facebook page for a new video posted in a playlist. 
and we can turn this zap on and then the next time we add a new video to that particular playlist then it will also make that posting to our Facebook pages page so again you can see how quickly and easily uh, we can also automate posting to our Facebook pages based on the addition of a video to a YouTube playlist. And that they post the appropriate messages to Pinterest and to our Facebook page. So I'm going to add a video to one of the playlists for which I have a zap mapped from YouTube to both Pinterest and the Facebook page I'll select the video to add I'll add that video to this game plans playlist in the Beach Bum Trading YouTube channel And then we'll go over to Zapier and we'll look at the Zap history. So if you click on Zap history here, then you have a choice and I'll do a separate video about how to monitor Zap runs and deal with issues in the Zap runs. But you have two selections, the task usage and the Zap runs. And if you refresh this periodically, it will update the history. So now we can see one of my zaps picked it up and mapped it to Discord. So you can see a previous video on how that one works. Okay, now the zap we worked on that maps from the YouTube playlist, from the Game Plan YouTube playlist to Pinterest and Facebook page ran successfully. We can see the green check mark in our zap history. So now we can go over to Pinterest and we can go to the game plans board in Pinterest and verify that it has been added there. And there's our new video posted to Pinterest from the automated zap and then we can go over to our Facebook page and refresh that and now we can also see that it posted automatically to our Facebook page just now with the description that we pasted in and customized in our Zapier Zap. So again you can see how quick and easy it is to create uh, Zaps in Zapier to update them, modify them for additional actions. Here we have a Zap that does multiple actions based on a single trigger and hopefully you can see how much more efficient and effective and productive that this can make you and your virtual consulting clients. So we hope that you like this. Please give us your feedback in the comments below on our Facebook groups uh, and our upcoming Discord, etc. And let us know what you think. What, let us know what other types of workflows uh, you would like to see us produce videos and for our Zapier tutorial. So again, we hope that this helps you see how uh, more efficient, effective, and productive that you can uh, be by automating workflows using Zapier and for your, how you can offer this as a service for your virtual consulting clients. And again, we hope you like all of this and uh, let us know what you think. So we hope this all helps you see the awesome potential for not only automating workflows within your virtual consulting business, but how you could also offer this as a service to automate workflows in your virtual consulting client's business. So we hope that you like this video. Uh, please let us know uh, other types of integrations between applications available in Zapier for which you'd like to see additional videos in our Zapier tutorial. We hope you will watch all of the other videos in our Zapier tutorial. And we please let us know in the comments below uh, any feedback, uh, recommendations for improvement, other Zaps you would like. Um, and we will try to accommodate those as best we are able. 
This video and the Virtual Consulting YouTube channel is powered by the Virtual Consulting Firm. Please also visit and follow us on social media via the links that you may find on our About page. In the top right, you can link to our Virtual Consulting home page. You can follow us on Twitter, LinkedIn, etc. You can also find our web hosting company and if you scroll to the bottom, you'll find additional links to some of our other social media sites, our Facebook site, our Instagram site. Also, we have. Uh, we hope you will join us in the Virtual Consulting Facebook group where we can discuss any topics and you can ask any questions related to virtual consulting and we'd be happy to help you succeed in your virtual consulting business, get started. Uh, and succeed in your virtual consulting business and also our Pinterest and again the web hosting company that we use for our homepage. So again we hope you will also choose to follow us on our social media sites, visit us, let us know what you think of all this, how can we help you. We hope this all helps and have a great day. Thank you for watching our video to the end. We hope that you liked it. Please smash the like button to help the YouTube al algorithm share our videos with more of your fellow virtual consultants around the world. Please share this on your social media and with your other virtual consultants around the world. If you're not already subscribed to our virtual consulting YouTube channel, we hope that you will choose to subscribe and please hit the bell icon to be notified as we release new content. Please provide us with your feedback in the comments below. Let us know how we can help you be more successful as a virtual consultant, get started as a virtual consultant, and be successful in your virtual consulting business. Again, thank you for watching our video to the end. We hope this all helps and have a great day. If you like this video, we hope you will choose to subscribe to our YouTube channel by clicking on the box in the upper left hand corner. You can watch another video like this by clicking on the box in the lower right hand corner. And we have a whole playlist of videos like this that you can access via the box in the upper right hand corner. Our latest video is available in the box in the lower left hand corner. We hope you like this and have a great day.